Hi everyone, it's Bengi here. In this video, I will show you how you can use mini course generator to create a LinkedIn carousel. As you know, having a strong and active LinkedIn profile is very important for solopreneurs and posting quality content regularly is also very important for that. For building a relationship with your audience, finding new clients maybe, and also growing your personal brand organically. On the other hand, the algorithm doesn't really like external links, so this makes the carousel feature even more popular. You need to share the content directly on LinkedIn. It's bite-sized engaging material, just like a mini course, right? So on mini course generator, we have a new feature. You can now export your mini courses as PDFs and they will be adjusted for sharing on LinkedIn in carousel format. You can either repurpose an existing mini course or create one from point zero just for LinkedIn. So let's dive in this video and see how it's done. In this video, I don't want to use an existing mini course and repurpose it uh, for LinkedIn Carousel, but rather create one from point zero with you. Uh, you see, our AI course creator here is very popular and it's great for getting you a comprehensive, a uh, big mini course, uh, but it will be quite overkill for our purpose now in this use case. So I just want to create a mini course, which is really, really small. So I'll start from scratch here and use AI inside my course this time. I want to create a course about uh, LinkedIn strategies. Let's name it here. Three tips for organic growth. If I choose to start from scratch, I get an empty card like this. A mini course is formed of cards. You add different types of content cards after each other and you get a mini course. And in this video, each of them will be a page of our LinkedIn carousel PDF. So I want to create an outline with AI. Uh, so I will ask a question and type three plus to get the answers and i can also use the three plus icon at the uh, bottom of the card these are the output suggestions by ai the first one looks good let's click on it and add directly to the card now uh, i will uh, divide this content to separate cards i will add cards uh, information cards and cut the content from the first card and copy to the other cards. Let's do it for each of them. Yes, after it's done, I will go back to the beginning and make an engaging introduction. And I will take help from AI again. I make a brief introduction and type three plus to learn the output suggestions, how I can continue this introduction. Yeah, a very brief introduction will be enough. I think I will choose the third option. Yes, but you see it's too long. So I need to divide this content to another card. It will look better on LinkedIn Carousel. Let's add another card in between here. Now it looks good overall. It's well organized, but needs some more visual touches. So let's adjust headers and other types of visual touches to the text part. Now, the next step is images. Uh, images will be very nice. Of course, we cannot use animated images or videos. Uh, they won't be visible on PDFs, but we can use uh, Unsplash integration or we can directly upload uh, from our device. Let's add images to every card on this mini course. Now let's add some questions to this mini course. I will add a quiz card. Of course, it will not be clickable in the PDF format, but it will still uh, cheer up the narrative a lot and also encourage my audience to leave a comment on my post. Uh, I want to create something about Carousel. So let's generate some information with three plus. And very quickly, I will turn it into a question by adding options. It looks good. Now let's another question at the end of the mini course this time. It will be a uh, feedback and survey type question. I choose open-ended. It will have a special view, you'll see. It will act like a CTA. I quickly overview the mini course and start adjusting my teams. As you can see, we have several team presets here. 
and we have color options for them as well. I like the fluid preset a lot and yellow will be good, I think. Let's apply this. And also I'd like to add my logo to this mini course. It will be visible on the cover page. Now let's preview under LinkedIn carousel option. So this is the cover of the carousel. And here you can see our logo. In order to see the cards, I will click see cards over here and review each page. Now, as you can see, the content is cut in half and the rest is moved to another card. Yeah, even though I try to keep it short, you see it's still too long for a single page. Let's close the carousel preview and fix these very quickly. I will divide the content to a second card. I will do the adjustment either by dividing the content into two cards or simply by forming another paragraph in the uh, same card. It's an easy job. Now, after making these adjustments, let's preview one more time. Let's see cards. Yes, it's much better now. The overall view is nice and this is how the quiz card looks. As you can see, we have call to action buttons at the uh, bottom of that question card and it will encourage people to get in touch with me in the comments or encourage them to like share this mini course let's scroll down to see the rest all in place now this is how the last card looks it's a survey card remember and it looks like this you can also change team settings and arrow type from edit team button over here you can switch to another preset and also you can directly edit current settings you'll see font colors button colors also font size and font type over here and at the very end you'll see arrow type the third one is good let's apply this and go back to the preview and download the mini course now let's go to my linkedin profile to share this engaging carousel to share this PDF, I click Add Document and choose my file. You can name the document from this area here. Let's check the preview very quickly. So far, so good. And post it. So you see, I have created content on Mini Course Generator with the help of AI Assistant. And I turned it into an engaging PDF and shared on LinkedIn in carousel format. In a few steps, it's done. If you'd like to see the end user interfaces yourself, you can find the link of this post in the description part of our video. Now, in this video, I have created a mini course from scratch with you. But if you already have a mini course that you'd like to repurpose for LinkedIn, you can do it the same way. Just keep in mind that the carousel format looks best with less text, more images and uh, not much pages. So it will be wise to summarize the whole thing into a shorter version. You can copy your original mini course by duplicating and make relevant adjustments directly on the copy version. Keep in mind that you can summarize text by using the 3 plus feature in our content cards. Besides, gateway cards and completion cards cannot be displayed on PDFs by its nature as they are interactive, so it will be wise to adjust the content accordingly. So it's all from me about Minicourse Generator's new LinkedIn Carousel feature. If you have any questions and feedback for us, please leave a comment and meet me in the next video.